So this paper is intended to provide clinicians with a concise summary of how to approach the patient with breast pain in terms of classifying their breast pain, evaluating them, and then providing appropriate treatment recommendations. So my name is Lauren Cornell. I am a diagnostic breast physician in the Jacoby Center for Breast Health at Mayo Clinic Florida. The paper that we have written is Current Management and Treatment Options for Breast Pain, and it's going to appear in the Mayo Clinic Proceedings. So actually about 70% of all women will experience breast pain at some point in their life. And um, the vast majority of these women, it does impact their quality of life. And so we want to equip physicians uh, with a, a quick summary of how they can approach these patients. Um, interestingly, um, the majority of these patients present, present to their providers because they are worried about a fear for breast cancer, but actually only about 5% of those women will actually um, be found to have breast cancer. And so we want to teach physicians how to know when to order appropriate diagnostic testing, and then for the majority of women who don't have breast cancer, to know how to treat them. So I think this paper is helpful in that it summarizes when breast pain would be worrisome and when to order appropriate diagnostic testing because not all patients need additional imaging. So being able to recognize who needs additional imaging, who needs additional evaluation, and who may be able to be treated with reassurance alone. So breast pain is not a new symptom, right? It's been around for a long time. There are a lot of patients who experience breast pain, um, and there are a lot of suggested treatment modalities out there, which we've summarized nicely in this paper. But um, unfortunately, a lot of these recommendations that are made regarding lifestyle, diet, supplements, there's not a lot of literature to back it up. And so I think we do need more research in terms of really the concrete evidence for some of these recommendations. There is a, a decent amount of literature already out there on breast pain, but it's quite extensive. And so we wanted to provide, again, a, a quick and concise summary of what's out there so that providers can turn to this and treat their patients more efficiently. We hope you found this presentation from the content of our website valuable. Our journal's mission is to promote the best interests of patients by advancing the knowledge and professionalism of the physician community. If you are interested in more information about us, our homepage is www.mayoclinicproceedings.org. There you'll find access to information for our social media content, such as additional videos on our YouTube channel or journal updates on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter. More information about healthcare at Mayo Clinic is available at www.mayoclinic.org. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.